Good day everybody, this is Chuck with CyberSmart Web Marketing Solutions and I'm going to do a video series on the Backup Buddy plugin by Plugin Buddy. This is an awesome plugin for backing up your Word, WordPress website and not only just for backing it up but if you're a, a web designer or a developer and you need to migrate your, your website this is this is the plugin to have. Now why would you want to back up your your WordPress website. Well, things happen sometimes. Your server can crash, you can get hacked, um, you can have uh, malware and malicious code uh, maliciously placed on your website. So it's a good idea to back up your website periodically. So what we're going to do is go over to the members panel of iThemes and once you sign up and get the plugin, you're going to have a dashboard like this with all of the things that you purchased from iThemes. And if you see right here, we have Backup Buddy 2.2.28. So what we're going to do is just click that, and we're going to save it to the desktop. Okay. And then we're going to go over. This is the site that I'm working on. This is a, a site I'm building with Builder um, for a friend of mine, Reese Art, Art Studios. So the first thing you want to do is go to your dashboard, and then over on the left hand side you'll see plugins and you'll want to click on the add new option now rather for then searching for plugins what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to upload the one from our desktop so we just click on upload we browse our folders and we find backup buddy we just click it hit open install now just like any other plugin. Might take a second or so here. Here we go. And then you want to activate the plugin. Now, if you notice, as soon as you got it installed, you're going to have another widget over on your left hand side here um, with all the different options. And we'll go to the Getting Started page here and look at some of the things it says here. It's got a nice write up. And you can do a full backup, you can do a database backup, and then you can restore and, mig and migrate your website. And that's what I'm going to do in this video series. But the first thing that we're going to want to do is we're going to want to do a full backup. So if we click on Backup and Restore, here we have our options. And the first thing we're want going to want to do is delete this. I already had a backup. So let's do it again. Let's full backup and this will take several minutes uh, depending how large your site is it's almost finished already okay so now if you if you wanted to you could download this to your desktop and you have a full backup in a zip file and you can also um, export it if you have a, um, a cloud host you can also store it on there if you don't want to take up the room on your on your own desktop and your own computer. So that's how we install it, and that's part one. And then we're going to get into migration in the next videos. All right, thanks.